Okay. I continue with my lecture on Qigong, my own elementary Qigong, as we're working with the elements. Today I want to connect power exercise, this one as a push up, with breathing and imagination. The principles are always the same. You have to know the lines where the meridians, where your energy is flowing, breathing in, inside, legs and arms, breathing out, outside, arms and legs. And if you want to, and in the middle it goes naturally, breathing in, spine to the top, breathing out, down to the periphery. And if you want to like to have a kind of cat-like power, then you can use it like I do. Okay, so I come in, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. And out. And so it goes. You can make 20, you can make 50 according to your ability to absorb cheap power from outside, from the trees and the air and from your good food and the breath and concentration of the energy flowing uh, helps you to utilize the synergy that is your muscles are working uh, exactly as they should there is no um, antagonist tension okay so it's smooth like a cat when she is moving yeah? so uh, when I come up here I have my breath is held and now I start to breathe out and first I do this I raise the breastbone 45 degrees up I utilize the latissimus dorsi muscles here that are attached here to the upper arm bone so that if you are hanging and just immediately try to push yourself up by using your biceps they usually you, you have tension here in your neck it's shaking and it is also mechanically mm, kind of destructive let us say if you are trying to from hanging trying to push the biceps up the tension on the sinews here is um, too high but whereas when you raise your breastbone okay a latissimus dorsi helps you to change the angle now you have this angle at which moment the power of the biceps is uh, the best okay okay so I hold it and I come down end of the breathing out I go away and I make this breathing in get hold of the bar and then okay and I, as I push myself up I feel the energy flowing here through the neck shoulder blade shoulder biceps and down the arms and I actually try and also naturally at the beginning here to the breast I try to follow it with my mind what I'm doing here. And at the same time I look at those beautiful trees and if they have strong branches I try to analogically be like the tree to have this enormous strength in my arms. Okay, once more. So, I 
Breathe now in. And now lift the chest. And now. Okay, I'm not going to use up uh, my time and your time by ch -ch 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 making uh, 20 or 50s maybe, but as you make the pause in between by breathing in, you can really make them, if you are in a kind of trance, you can really make 50. I bet, if you are trained. So, uh, this is a different concept to just, you know, coming in and making like like a machine and running again it is uh, and then I have a series of other exercises which are similar to this no? this one okay works the same way energy is here and I go down and use the breath in the same time and I have this one okay for the treat set this naturally is faster but you follow the energy um, doesn't matter if it goes fast or slow you simply flow it to your body and after a series of four exercises like this I always have a longer qigong harmonizing exercise you know, when I feel when I stretch my arm into those trees with energy circling through the palm through my arm to the center of the body both arms and the legs and I conserve it here in my Hara center so this would be again uh, a training for somebody who wants to have the aesthetic and the harmony and the breathing and the imagination combined. Power and Qigong by Harris Pavlos. Okay, bye bye.